The START program, which stands for a Short-Term Assessment Response Treatment Team, it's a program that responds to youth or young adults uh, that have a mental health crisis. What the program tries to do is not only respond to crisis in the moment, but also link children and youth and their families to a range of mental health and substance use supports. Well, within the uh, Fraser communities, uh, we have one third of the population, which is about 1.6 million. Of the 1.6 million, 21% are actually youth under the age of 18. What was happening is when youth are in crisis, um, general practitioner doctors were making referrals for youth to, directly to hospital. And that was an impact in terms of the system. The START program of dealing with a youth within 24 hours of, of referral is astonishing. The ability to have a clinician to actually go out to see that young person in community, whether it's within a school setting, during the extended hours over the weekend, it's meeting the needs at, at their time, their place, their location. Historically, we saw around 4,000 children and youth in emergency rooms up to age 19. So um, one of the challenges was is just to responding to the volume of calls. Another challenge was just ensuring that we did a good job of uh, reaching out and doing the communication piece to ensure that families, youth themselves, schools knew how to make the link or make a call to the START program and knew how to receive that service. My son's um, journey with mental illness started approximately nine years ago following a series of strokes. And this past fall in particular, we saw kind of this obsessiveness, um, all or nothing thinking that was really affecting his self-esteem and how he approached his studies as well. How we found out about this program was through my son's school. His counselor recommended this program. The START program has impacted so many of the students and families that I have worked with. Um, when the START team has clients that they're working with who are in our schools, they will come into our schools and work with the kids there if that is easier and less threatening and less difficult for the student because if we understand where the behavior is coming from and we know how to then treat it and support it, all of that surface concerning scary stuff can go away. Uh, and for the family, that now they understand what's happening, they know how to support it. What is really important to me is I'll be able to tap into what my son's God-given talents are and build on those strengths, his overall outlook to life, his overall happiness. And that's why I appreciate the START team and helping facilitate that. With the Ministry of Children and Family Development providing the services for child youth mental health, it's about uh, our partnership and our organizational relationship with Fraser Health. Our work with our clinicians, our work with our partnership at leadership, really looked at the overall focus in terms of changing the outcomes and the trajectory for a youth in crisis. To connect with that youth at the time of crisis, to stabilize, assess, find the right resource, and actually calm the situation down. Phenomenal.